wise King Solomon. King David had a son named Solomon. Solomon became the next king after David. Solomon loved God and worshipped Him, and was a good king. One night, Solomon had a dream. The Lord spoke to him in a dream and said, "Ask for whatever you want, and I will give it to you." Solomon could have asked for money to be very rich. He could have asked to be healthy and live a very long life. He could have asked to have peace with all the countries around his country. But Solomon did not ask for those things. This is what Solomon said: "Lord, you have shown great kindness to my father David, because he was righteous and obeyed you. Now." You have made me king in place of my father, but I am young. I do not know how to do the things that I have to do as a king. I have many people in my kingdom that need my help. Please give me a wise and understanding mind, so that I may know the difference between right and wrong. The Lord was very pleased with Solomon's request. This is what the Lord said to Solomon. I will give you a wise and understanding mind, so that there will never be anyone as wise as you. But that's not all I will give you. I will also give you what you have not asked for. I will give you riches and honor. If you continue to obey my commands, I will also give you a long life. Then Solomon awoke from his sleep and realized that he had been dreaming. God kept His promise and gave Solomon wisdom. Solomon was able to help the people in his kingdom when they didn't know what to do. People came to him to ask for his help and to hear him teach. All the decisions Solomon made were wise and fair. God also made Solomon rich and gave him peace with the countries that were around him. Solomon made such a great choice. To ask God for wisdom, God wants to give us wisdom and help us make right decisions. Also, all we need to do is pray and ask God when we don't know what to do, and God promises to give us wisdom.